Oh, pilots and ground crew. Uh, just a quick video because uh, I don't know if you can tell, but the sun's out, so I've just charged some batteries up, so I'm gonna hit the field. However, I thought I'll just put this out fast, it should only be a couple of minutes or so. Uh, I recently did a video on these tiny little stubby antennas, and uh, somebody had left uh, in the description, uh, what was his name? Little D. I like a little dragon, so a dragon, a devil, so a little D, little devil, I suppose. But anyway, uh, he'd asked me what do they look like on the inside, and I thought, good question. So I've cut one open, right, which I don't recommend you doing. I had to get a little knife, and it, it was a bit fiddly, but I cut one open to have a look. So let's get to the table, zoom in, hope it's in focus, and show you. Cheers. Right then pilots, there you go then, like I said I cracked one open and it's a bit strange to be honest, now I'm no expert in electronics but it's not a clover leaf and it's definitely not, well I say definitely, it could be a pagoda, <laughs> it, it's a bit weird, let me just find a point here, if I turn it up that way I hope you can see inside there, it, <laughs> it's got like a little spiral which is like a pagoda yet different because the actual uh, well signal points that come out, the wires are curved and you've got these, uh, I don't know what they're for, I'm not going to lie to you Hopefully somebody else will uh, do a video and tell you. you got these little, uh, well I suppose like soldering pads or points on the sides coming off. But only on three sides. And turn it back on the side again. This here that you're looking at, this multicoloured yellow, brown, white, whatever. Is like a little plastic shield that's running all the way around. However, it stops halfway. Now, I thought, when I opened it up, I thought, oh, I've split it. I've uh, made a blob. However, I had a look inside one of my other ones, and they're identical. They only go so far, and then uh, this little plastic casing stops. So, like I said, I was asked the question, so I've opened it up to have a look. And your connector just goes into this little plastic case. I don't recommend you opening them up actually. Right? Because I had to get a Stanley knife and cut all the way around it. it. It was very awkward to say the least. And I was worried I was going to break the thing. But uh, there you go. I'll have to... Uh, it just slots in. And... I'll have to put a piece of glue now or some uh, heat shrink or something just to hold the top case and the bottom case in. But uh, yeah, there you go. Answered the question I was asked by, uh, what was his name? As he looks at the book, Little D. Cool, I like it. Anyway, uh, there you go then, uh, little D, and if anybody else is interested, that's why this is just a quick video, just to show you what these little antennas are like on the inside. Right, hope that helps, thanks for watching, uh, please subscribe, leave thumbs up or thumbs down, however you feel, and cheers.